Welcome back. Right, we've skipped forward a few months. Nothing really happened. I did sell eggs, which I will put the price of what, or what we need, the total money we got for the eggs. Uh, right, we are really, we're going to be really busy today. Or this month. We've got rain on the way, which is not going to help matters. But we have got all of our canola fields are ready to harvest. Our wheat field is ready to harvest. It's going to be full on today. Absolutely full on. But look, just look at that beautiful fields. Our farm really is growing. And you'll notice we're sitting at 455,000. 466 euros. So we're well on our way of getting our, our um, cow barn. Getting the cows and getting all the machinery that's required. I love seeing that yield bonus of 100%. So good. So we have got so much to do, and I know uh, so much to do, but yet you're just flying over your fields. I know, I know, but I want to show you just exactly what the monumental uh, efforts can be required to do. There we go. Right, I'm going to jump in the harvester and start harvesting. my words escape me. The wheat field 49 is done. We're just washing down all the equipment before we start on the canola so there's no uh, cross contamination. And we'll head up and get that done. We're probably going to start, in fact, what, what field will I'll start on the furthest away field. So 28 is going to be the one we start on first with canola. We're going to fill it directly to the mill and see how we go on.
day in game I have spent doing things I cannot believe we have harvested four fields it doesn't sound like much four fields not sound like much however I'm going to give you a breakdown of each thing we have this this combine harvester used to be yellow believe it or not look at the state of it it deserves a it's been a hard working machine today hardest working machine out of everything that's on the farm except me <laughs> so Wheatfield 49, which is directly in front of the sheds over there, uh, gave us 31,416 litres of wheat, which is, is actually pretty good. Each of the chicken coops takes nine entire litres of um, wheat or barley. So that would give us about... That yeah, would give us a, a good few months. I would think, um, and bear in mind we obviously have the wheat and barley already in the silo as well. So, that's it's just going to kind of top things up for us, which is ideal. Right, on to the, the, uh, the, some of the big stats now. I couldn't believe these figures, so I couldn't. So, field 28, which is the smallest of the three fields, which had canola growing in them, it gave us 36,946 litres. So nearly 37,000 litres of canola, which is pretty good, considering I think I was almost all of our canola from last year. The... Let me just jump over to the mill. Chickens have... I mean, we're way behind with our eggs now, but we'll need to sort that out. So, for field 30... Let me just bring them up so that you can get a rough idea. So, field 30, which is our largest field, it produced 88,308 litres. Field 32, which I've just finished, is, gave us 47,763 litres. So in total, we harvested 173,017 litres of canola. Just over 173,000. Now, I found the limit to the oil mill, and it is 144,000. That's uh, the maximum it can hold for that. I dare say it could possibly hold the same. It must have separate tanks for each um, crop. So we're going to start it rolling with that, the canola. Activate that. So two canola gives us one, I'm assuming is that one bottle, one litre. Um, it's quite a high turnover. It produces 4,800 per cycle. Which is pretty good. Why? Why is that lamp on and the rest aren't. Oh, it is. Okay, it's just the way. I, I couldn't see it from the angle. Um, okay, so the extra 37,000 or 30 odd thousand that we couldn't store in the grain mill or in the oil mill, even I couldn't get the words there, has stored over in our silo. Which is I so our silo now has um, canola, wheat and barley in it so we, we've got lots um, I fed the chickens with the first trailer of wheat and then the rest of the wheat went in here which is absolutely ideal right oh my word it is now in game it is now ha past half past five it's 41 minutes past I always get around for that. It's 19 minutes to 6. I don't know. <laughs> oh man. In game, I'm physically so tired I can't even speak properly. We have absolutely destroyed today. Today has been an awesome day. We have. I've also, whilst harvesting, I've mulched 
field 28 and field 30, so the only field left to mulch is 32, because in August we start planting canola again, and then I think it's September, is the September's for wheat and barley. So that gives us a little bit of a staggered break. Um, the wheat we could have left till next month, um, it really wasn't a major burning issue, but I just decided to get it done today, and it's all done. We have forty-four. We have four hundred and fifty-four thousand five hundred and one euros. I estimate over the next month or two months, we're going to we're going to smash our goal of six hundred thousand, which is going to then allow us to buy the cow barn, the machinery, and then we can look at buying the cows, and then we're going to start the total mix ration. Next video, maybe that video, but. Definitely we will be planting canola in the three fields, uh, mulching th field 32 to give us a better yield bonus and cutting the grass down in 33 to create some more hay bales which is then we're stockpiling so that's what we're going to do. Until then don't forget to hit the like button, if you're not already subscribed please consider subscribing and until next time take care stay safe bye bye.